So what about using RPKI? What should we do? Well, network operators can make decisions based on the RPKI state. Invalid, discard the prefix. Several operators are already doing this today, and more operators are doing this as part of the improved migration and securing of their networks. The not found state is being allowed through, and perhaps you make this a low local preference. Valid, we let it through, and we make it high local preference. Some operators have talked about making not found a discard event, probably not very seriously, because if they do that, the internet routing table would shrink substantially in both v4 and v6. Now let's look at some of the deployment situations and some of the challenges. For fully supported route origin validation across the network, all eBGP speaking routers need to talk with a validator. Supporting route origin validation means we are dropping invalids as they arrive in the network. eBGP speaking routers are part of the operator iBGP mesh. iBGP speaking routers do not need to talk to a validator because only the valid and not found prefixes will be distributed from the eBGP speaking routers. A note, the validation table is local to the router. There's no protocol for distributing this table from one router to another. But do note, on Cisco IOS and IOS XE, the routers will drop invalids by default. If you want to allow invalids to be distributed by iBGP, there is the per address family command BGP best path prefix validate allow invalid. With this implemented, iOS and IOXE will not drop invalids by default, but distribute them across the iBGP mesh. 